The joyous celebration of the Omagongo Annual Festival was a colorful event which displayed the processing of Marura brew or juice. This group of women carry clay pots filled with omagongo, which was enjoyed by the elders during the festival. At the occasion, the extraction of marura juice and oil was dramatized by elderly women, in this way teaching the future generation how to preserve their culture and tradition. The unifying festival is hosted on a rotational basis by each of the eight Awambo communities. Next year, the festivities will take place at Ombala Kwaludi. In his keynote speech, President Gagob urged Namibians to remain true to their cultures and traditions and follow established age-old practices of solving disagreements without resorting to disrespect and speaking ill of one's elders. In Africa, our, our traditions, our, our beliefs, and customs and norms are all underpinned by the principle of respect, most importantly, respect for and to our elders. There is an African proverb which says, a man who pays respect to the great Pays way for his own greatness. In Africa, our elders are the great. African cultural values are based on a foundation of the past and present. And this is a leading reason why elders must be respected. He says at the time when the world is faced with intolerance and hatred characterized by war and international terrorism, Namibians should take pride in being able to practice harmony, peace and love in their communities through cultural celebrations. To show the world that Namibia is a heaven, not only for cultural harmony and peace, but also for the promotion of human dignity and respect. The head of state called on Namibians to embrace their respective cultural heritage in a spirit of national pride and patriotism. For NBC News, Tanatenish Tile, Ukwambi.